Welcome back to Cesspericasm. We just booked two more nights here at the cheaper room in Surat Thani. So we'll be staying here till at least Monday morning. Right now we are getting ready to leave the hotel room to head to this hilly area somewhere in the city and probably check out some viewpoints along the way. arrived at this little viewpoint area up on top of a hill here in Surat Thani. Behind me is Surat Thani, a town in the province of Surat Thani. I've noticed that in Thailand here there's provinces and towns and lots of the provinces have a town that has the same name. Surat Thani also means city of good people in Thai and there's no real major tourist attractions in this city. The main reason people who are visiting Thailand come here are to catch ferries and boats over to the islands on this coast of Thailand, the main ones being Koh Phan Yang, Koh Samui, and Koh Tao. We found some sort of shrine here at the top of the hill. just left the hillside and came down to this small local Thai restaurant and we're all getting some noodle soup. Since we ate lunch earlier, I've just been hanging out at the hotel, took a short nap to catch up on rest and got some computer work done. Now we just came down to a giant night market near the river here in Surat Thani. It's supposed to be a huge market and by the looks of it, it is massive. At the night market, I spent 120 baht on all that food, which is equivalent to $3.50 US cents. That was for 12 pieces of sushi, one chicken on a stick, and one batch of fried mussels with vegetables. Now we are at a pillar shrine here in Surat Thani, where lots of the local Thai people come to pray. today's vlog. Thank you for tuning into Cesspericasm and I'll see you in the future. Peace!